if you're not anticipating a visit from the ATF, you can view it. And when the ATF comes, nobody has to know what's inside. Ladies and gentlemen, today I have something incredibly special. We have so many subscribers that reach out to us and they want a really nice home on acreage, but usually you either get the acreage or the really nice home. Well, our newest listing brings you both. This incredible custom home is certainly an exception to the rule. It features four bedrooms, two and a half bathrooms, over 2,300 square feet of livable space, as well as a two car plus RV garage offering over 1,600 square feet of garage space. Total lot size is just a little over an acre. It comes with horse privileges, and every square foot of this incredible property has been loaded with upgrades and built to the highest standards. Folks, aside from this property being a horse property, which I'm super excited about, and I know we have so many clients that are looking at properties that have horse privileges that are not too far away from town, there's another huge incentive to buy this home. The seller is currently offering this property at just $899.9, and there's also a $10,000 credit that you could use towards a two on buy down if you need financing, use it towards your closing costs, you could use it however you'd like. It is a great opportunity to get into this home while securing financing at a much better rate right now, prior to the raise dropping and property values increasing. So this may be the great buy that you have been waiting for. I'm excited to show you this home. Let's check it out. As you can see from the front of this property, the guest suite or an office has its own private courtyard. So you have a little hangout area on the front of the property. The views in every single direction are absolutely incredible. We are in Apple Valley. Let's talk a little bit about location before we head inside. So we are in Apple Valley, which is about 25 to 30 minutes away from Hurricane, about 45 minutes away from downtown St. George. You're really close to Zion National Park. You're practically in the backyard and you're surrounded by all of the best things that Southern Utah has to offer. There's hiking, biking, some of the most sought after uh, dirt bike and mountain bike trails like Gooseberry Mesa that I'm sure you guys have heard of if you're researching this area, but let's, let's head inside and check out this incredible home. So. Right off the front, you have um, a little courtyard that leads you into the office or the guest suite, however you like to set that up. And the front has a very modern door. The flooring is tiled throughout this area. And I'll, I'll kind of show you guys the entryway first. And before we get any further, want to show you this office. Our client currently has this space set up as an office, but it could be easily turned into a mother-in-law suite, a guest bedroom, but it has some really nice built-ins on this wall and has some even nicer built-ins on the wall directly across from it. If you're not anticipating a visit from the ATF, you can view it. And when the ATF comes, Nobody has to know what's inside. There is a slider that takes you out into the courtyard that we just checked out from the outside. This door opens into this beautiful space. And again, you have views from literally every angle. And there was a substantial amount of money that was spent on this. Just to give you guys an idea, just the glass alone was over $5,000. And this entire house has pre-wired surround sound system including this room. There are two speakers installed in the ceiling. Let's go out and check out the main living space. It's the part of this house that absolutely appeals to me because these views are incredible. This entire area is very spacious. You have tile flooring throughout, custom cabinets in this kitchen. And as we look at the view side of things, you have a triple slider that opens up to this massive rear patio. And you can take in the views. You could turn this into an indoor outdoor space. And another thing, if you're, if you're new to the area, Apple Valley sits about a thousand feet above Hurricane, which puts us at 4,794 feet to be exact above sea level. So temperatures here are a little bit cooler and you could really enjoy this space for most of the year, at least early mornings, late afternoons, 
the, the weather here is quite a bit cooler than St. George, so that space is a lot more usable. This triple slider takes us outside and it can fold all the way back to allow an even bigger opening to this incredible landscape. As we step out here, this home is equipped with a great outdoor kitchen that has a sink, an ice maker, and then here you could accompany it with either grill of your choice or smoker. There's definitely an opportunity to make this space very modular and customize it to your specific needs. A little portion that's fenced in and landscaped to keep your pets in. And then the rest of that acre kind of sprawls across the back of this property. Uh, you have your horse corral, as well as the barn back here with custom barn doors. And the owner actually also has plans for a potential shop that could go down below. That space has been compacted and even the footings are already in. Right outside the master, as you guys saw these double doors from the inside, you have a spa with a little sitting area. And take a look at these incredible views. We'll talk a little bit more about the outside. Let's check out this kitchen. This kitchen island is absolutely massive. It comfortably fits four bar stools on this side, and it almost feels square because of how deep it is, giving you plenty of room to entertain and plenty of room for prep area. The back counters are finished with black leather, and I absolutely love this finish for, for countertops. It looks and feels incredible. This home has gas, Cafe Series GE appliances with a pot filler, matching GE dishwasher, double oven on this side, and the microwave is located inside of this pantry that has a really cool countertop and some more custom cabinetry up above the microwave. This room has surround sound that's built in and connected throughout the entire house. The appliances can be controlled remotely from your phone. The thermostat can be controlled remotely from your phone. And this home was built by the builder for the builder, so it was entirely overbuilt. Living room has surround sound throughout. I believe it's a 5.1 system with high-end built-in speakers, as well as some of these nice built-ins on the front, some floating shelving and a insert fireplace. This space is nice and open and there's plenty of room to entertain. It comfortably fits a large sofa, so you have plenty of room to gather. Let's just go down this hallway. That's the owner's wing of this home. There is a nice linen closet right outside of the master suite. And the size of this master suite is truly astonishing because the, the king size bed kind of just disappears in here. You have a French door that opens onto the back patio. And I have actually come to appreciate fewer sliders and more actual doors in your home because sometimes sliding doors could be a bit to maintain. But as you can see, this room comfortably fits a king size bed, bariatric chamber, an infrared sauna on the other end. And there's still room for other furniture and things in here. And the views are absolutely incredible. The blinds in this room are automated and they're controlled with this remote. So you can completely black out this space if you don't want to uh, see these beautiful views for whatever reason, you're just trying to go to sleep. Another important thing to point out about this space is it has its own climate zone. So you could make this room as warm or as cold as you would like while keeping the rest of the house consistent. As we enter this master bath, we have a large soaking tub with some beautiful detail for this backsplash and two mirrors that kind of tie these vanities together. There's some beautiful tile work all the way from floor to ceiling in the shower. It does have a rainfall shower and two heads on a wall. This room also has surround sound. And one thing that is very rare to find in Southern Utah homes, this room actually has heated flooring. 
There's a control switch for the heated flooring on the wall. So you could have your floors nice and warm. When you roll out of bed, you don't have to worry about stepping on cold tile. Designated water closet. A little linen closet directly across. And a really good size master dressing with some more built-ins and it's just overall beautifully finished. The carpet pad feels very squishy, very plush. And take a look at that. We walk out to a completely blacked out room. We lift these shades up because I do appreciate these views. As we go towards the front of the property, we have two bedrooms. They're both generous in size and they also have some really nice views from literally every direction. Right now, the blinds are down, so they're blacked out, but the front of the property looks at some really nice hillside. This room is currently decorated with some really tasteful Western decor. And then this guest suite is just about similar in size. It has a really nice built-in little reading nook and it comfortably fits a queen, but I believe you could probably squeeze in a king in here as well. As we walk down this hallway, this is your guest slash non-primary suit wing of the home bathroom. Has some nice black leather finish on the countertops, consistent cabinetry throughout, and a shower top combo. Another uh, really exciting piece of this home is the garage. And as we advance there, there are a couple more areas for us to check out. Now let's go check out the laundry room and the garage. As we go there, I want to show you guys one more thing. I'll show you in the garage. This home does have central vacuum cleaner, keeping the vacuum and the canister outside. So all the mass stays out here. And each room just has, actually this room has the hose that reaches the entire house. And when you're done, it just sucks itself in the wall. <laughs> As we walk down this hallway, we step over adorable French bulldog that does not convey with the property. The laundry room has a really nice sink with consistent countertops that match the rest of the house. There is a clothes bar and two really good sized cabinets directly across from laundry. We have a powder bath that is easily accessible as soon as you run in or run out of the house. This door takes us into a two car garage and that is the canister for the central vacuum cleaner. And the floors have been recently sealed. Folks, it's been less than a year since this home has been completed. So it feels, looks and smells completely brand new. This door takes us out into an oversized RV garage. RV bay is 60 feet deep by 20 feet wide with 17 foot ceilings. It has 50 amp power and a clean out. And as you can see, you could comfortably fit a Super Duty and a small trailer or possibly a crazy large RV and still have some space for workbenches and things of that nature throughout this side of the RV bay, there are uh, several windows on this side that allow plenty of natural light, as well as tons of lighting up above, making this perfect for a shop, RV garage, toy garage, however you'd want to use it. In fact, I'd like to know in the comments below, how would you use that space? And now we're going to go say hi to the horse. So as I mentioned in the beginning of this video, this property sits on just a little bit over an acre. It's a 1.02 acre lot and it has a fully insulated barn that has electricity ran to it and it's insulated with OSB and plywood on the inside so it cannot be kicked through by the horse. This area that we're walking through has been compacted and the owner has a set of plans for a 30 by 40 shop that could be placed right here. So if you wanted to place a large substantial shop, like if that massive 1600, almost 1700 square foot RV garage wasn't enough, 
you could construct a 30 by 40 shop back here to add additional room for your toys, hobbies, or anything else that you may want to do with that shop. So the barn was literally just finished. It has some beautiful corrals around it. The horses have absolutely no shortage of views. And if we get lucky, he'll come out and say hello to us. This horse is absolutely beautiful. Hello, how do you like living here? <laughs> You're so gorgeous. He's a handsome fella. He's a handsome fella, yes. And take in these views. You have views in literally every single direction. There is endless amount of outdoor activities. Folks, if you're interested in seeing this home in person, DM me, drop me a comment. Let me know if you'd like to check it out. I will also, as always, post the link to the entire MLS listing in the description below this video. If you've ever dreamt of living inside of National Park, this is about as close as it's gonna get. Zion is literally in your backyard. World famous Gooseberry Mesa is right next to you, as well as numerous trails for off-road riding, dirt biking, mountain biking, hiking. If you're into everything the Southwest United States has to offer, this home should be really high up on your list. I think that's it. Did we forget anything? Did I forget anything? Oh yeah, should follow and subscribe for more.